Harry, your thoughts on that one tonight? Yeah, good three points. I think it was all about bouncing back. I think from uh, obviously the weekend um, just gone, it was important. We got three points, however, however it came, and we got back to winning ways. And yeah, I'm just delighted we've done that clean sheet. So yeah, it's all in all a good night. You had to be patient, it's an awful lot of the ball tonight, but just waiting for those opportunities to come. Yeah, I think I think we definitely deserved three points. Again, it was just frustrating, was maybe, I think at first half was a bit timid. I think we didn't uh, properly sort of have that belief, but I think second half, especially we had a 20 minute spell and you could almost feel it come in, but then it, the goal didn't, and then you're thinking, oh no, but yeah, luckily, um, yeah, we all dug in and uh, we sort of kept that belief. And luckily I, I managed to arrive in the boxing and get that goal which um, yeah it's massive for obviously the team and, and me as well because I wanted to put it right from uh, the other weekend I was going to ask you did you think it was going to come you know as time went on yeah there was a couple of things obviously it was final final pass maybe or the final thing but um, I think you got to keep the belief and uh, we're still getting in really good areas still opening them up at times so you've got to just keep that belief and sometimes like there's going to be a lot of games like this and um, yeah it can come down to maybe the last minute you just got to keep keep going keep pushing and um, I felt I felt like we we were doing that um, and that and that's why the goal come you know, it just takes a sort of moment for their defender to switch off or a mistake and uh, to capital capitalize and luckily we created a good goal talk us through it uh, yeah so I think I think it was just Stez um, put a great ball in and yeah I managed to just well to just hit the target obviously Bill's sort of got across the defender which has allowed me to go in behind him have uh, a bit of space and yeah it was just important I kept, kept it down kept the finish down and yeah luckily I found, found the corner which um, yeah it was a, a great feeling with especially 10 minutes to go and then we um, can see the game out which, which we're good at doing What's this last couple of weeks like been for you personally? I know an awful lot of frustration from you over that decision at MK Dons and then obviously you have to sit on the sidelines for the, for the next game after that. Yeah, it's been tough. Um, obviously what happened at MK Dons, I was really disappointed um, whether, whether to send it off or not. I didn't want to, I was disappointed that I put like my teammates and the staff and the gaffer in that sort of position. So I said after the game, like I was determined to put it right. And um, yeah, I'm just, I'm just glad I have. Um, yeah, I was motivated and determined to um, obviously sort of pay, pay the team back and pay the fans back and luckily um, well I hope I have done tonight Lads all get round because I know you do nothing for you to take the blame for but everybody get round here and yeah, them after that. yeah they did obviously it was, a, it was a long time in that changing room on my own obviously uh, a couple of lads and the staff come to see me uh, join that but it was, a, it was a long time it was it, it weren't, it was a lonely place I was frustrated so yeah it was. I appreciate all the, all the team uh, and the gaffer that got round me straight away um, and yeah so I was just determined to put it right obviously I had to wait quite a, like over a week uh, was it so um, yeah so yeah I'm just delighted today that I was I was just determined to sort of put it right and I'm thankful that, that I have and now I can look forward and put that be, behind me now What's it been like in the, in the camp overall over these last couple of weeks because some frustrating outings that one in particular but then on Saturday as well the performance not quite what everybody were looking for but how has it been in the group has everybody been able to stay kind of calm and, and focused yeah I think it's important I think obviously we um, sort of went through the, the Chesterfield game and yeah maybe it was a drop in sort of some performances but also what what went on was just uh, a bit crazy and then like the, the it was a soft penalty it was never a penalty and obviously when things like that go against you it's always hard but um yeah we sort of had to just focus straight away on on this game and i think that's the beauty in football like we wasn't waiting too long we was waiting from the weekend we've got this game tonight and um yeah it was just important we bounced back so yeah it was important to just sort of keep karma in a good position and, and all it takes is a good win to get you sort of Back, back up to it and back, back on that run. Has tonight been kind of a, a real indication of the strength in depth? You know, five changes coming into this game. We've not seen that really in between league games before, but the performance overall tonight really good. Yeah, definitely. It was touched on it um, after the game as well. The the subs, the the strength in on the bench that we can bring on is massive to to help us out and help us get over the line as well. So yeah, it's, it's huge sort of the depth we've got and and it so it's the competition as well. Like um, if if we drop uh, in, in sort of standards or performance we know we've got someone who's who's ready to sort of take your shirt so it's it's sort of good competition and uh, it keeps everyone pushing and ultimately ultimately it's um you'll get you'll get a winning team you'll get we're all striving for that 
sort of success so everyone's sort of pulling in the right di direction and when when you're asked to to perform um yeah you, you're even more motivated to do that attention will turn to a game a, a big game for you at the weekend i imagine personally yeah yeah it's a game uh, obviously that i was aware of from the fixtures it's it's come round quick uh, now we're getting right into the sort of depth of the season um yeah they're, they're doing obviously really well uh, i think there's three wins on the bounce now so we know it's going to be a real tough game it'll be a weird experience for me but i'm just glad that we're sort of going in after the, um, a win tonight uh, and a decent performance obviously a lot to uh, improve on as well um but yeah i'm just happy that we're sort of going in with a bit of form and yeah we'll see what what happens it'll be an interesting interesting game but one that obviously we need to go there and um if if we want to be where we want to be in the season, we've got to go to places like that and, and teams who are in form and, and, and deliver really. So yeah, well, that's all focus now for Saturday. You've had plenty of experience of these fixtures on the other side of things, but always kind of, you know, a fiery occasion. You know, there's always plenty. The supporters are bang up for it as, as the teams are. As well. Yeah, definitely. I mean, it'll be a great atmosphere. I'm sure we're taking um, a sellout. Um, and yeah, just speaking to some fans and, and like the staff, they always like coming uh, away to uh, like Grimsby uh, just because of the atmosphere. And it's always a good game, a good entertaining game. It's been a mix, mixed bag of results, um, both home and away uh, over the last few years. So yeah, it'll be an interesting one and, and two um, really good teams. So yeah, looking forward to it now.